Today we're having an interprofessional simulation event where we're having our nursing majors and the PA majors work with DeSales EMS and actually travel to five different stations to rapidly triage victims of five different types of disaster events. Get me out of here. I can't see anything. Traditionally in the past this was a group exercise with the community EMS and fire services and our students took a little bit more of a passive role. This year we decided to make the students the focus of the exercise. The five events that they're actually involved with today is a lightning strike, a deck collapse, a motor vehicle accident, an explosion that results in burns, and a gunshot at a clinic. So all these are definitely scenarios that happen in our contemporary society too often, very sadly, and our healthcare professionals need to know while they're here in school how to respond to this type of scenario when they're out in the real world. Sir, can you hear me? If they were driving in their car and they came across one of these scenes, they now know what to do to say who's priority, who's sickest, so that when EMS gets there, they can really work in conjunction with them and be an active participant in taking care of these patients. Each and every one of these situations are something that happens out in the community. Virtually every day you hear or read about something similar. This is really great for the students because it shows them what they might encounter in the future. We're hearing uh, some very good comments that they like the ability to get in hands-on with simulated patients that are really helpful because as compared to previous years where we had quite a bit of local community EMS involvement, now they're actually patient one-on-one -on -one and learning directly. Do you know what happened? What? Do you know what happened?